we're going to be decorating this pumpkin head. Now, he came from the um, at-home store, so you can pick him up there. He is really cool. He makes some scary, creepy noises. Listen to him. Ready? It's so exciting. <laughs> He's creepy. He's super creepy. And our decorations here at the house, I don't like things to be too scary. So he does have kind of a scary face, but we're going to bling him out to make him look... Um, kind of whimsical. We're going to add a lot of candy and have so much fun. I'm not a fan of spray foam. So I just use regular floral foam. I attach that on there with hot glue. I also like to use Gorilla Glue. I use a combination of both to put on there to get this nice and strong. Here's what we're going to do. I want to start off with some of these um, branches, these really, really cool black and white branches. We are going to put them on here and get going. I'm going to spread them out first. I like to use things like this as hair kind of framing out the face and kind of just like we would greenery in a reef. So you're going to see me start to uh, shape this up. I'm going to use these to frame it out really nicely. They are so much fun. So I'm going to start uh, framing them out. I would, you also want to check your local grocery stores because last year my grocery store, H-E-B, I love our H-E-B. At the last minute, don't you love his hair? Look at his hair already. It's super cool. Uh, last year at the last moment, they got in some really cute witches that had this big mouth. And whenever I get mine out of the warehouse, we'll try to make something with it. But I thought that would be so much fun to uh, to decorate him too. So check everywhere for something like that. Love, love, love him. Okay, I'm gonna go on this other side. So I'm just kind of shaping out my base uh, so far. I'm just going into my phone. Wait till y'all see, oh my gosh, this is gonna be so cute. I'm so excited about him. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna put, let's see, I'm putting in five it to start with. And we can always, we're going to need some to fill in the front, but I just want to frame this out. So like I would teach you in design school, we're setting the perimeter of our design. Same thing, same thing to get going. Now, wait till you see. Now, so far he just looks scarier, but you could totally make him scarier. Oh my God, you could put a skeleton sitting up here, popping out in front. Y'all, the, the things are unlimited, you could do. But I want to use this really cute pumpkin stack that we already have. Look at this. <sighs> Look at this. I am going to uh, cut this one off, put this price tag off. It's got an elastic band around there. Let me just get that off. So I want this to be really whimsical and kind of popping off his head. Oh yeah. Yeah, like he's like he's a drunk pumpkin and he thinks it's funny to put these other pumpkins on his head. So we're gonna put that up there. So far I've just put a dowel rod in there and I'm gonna get it in some glue and we'll just push that in. Yes, I like it kind of cockeyed. Isn't that cute? Isn't that cute? Now. Uh, we're gonna go all candy because I remember I want to make him really cute and not so scary like this. They have balls. I love the balls. They have the marshmallows and they have the black that'll pull out the black from the back. So we're gonna use a few of these in there and we're gonna use these in here to kind of soften the black up at the top and spread these around. Kind of get our shape going. So it's a little, I just get things I like even at the at home store. If I run in there, I pick up things I might want to use next year. If I don't get to them, I just wait. But I like to kind of make them special for me to go with what I want. I mean, gosh, y'all, he's gonna be cute. Oh my gosh, I'm excited. Wait till we add the bows. I mean, this is a crown of glory on here. It's gonna be super cute. I'm excited about it. All right, let's bring it down the other side over here. He's gonna be like the king of candy corn. Candy corn king. All right, how about one more here? And then I'm gonna put the lollipops in next because they have the height. Let me grab, oh, I may only have two of those. No, I've got one more. Oh, I've got all the candy color. Oh, good times are coming. This is so cute. I'm so excited already. Okay, let's put some lollipops in yet. These are gonna work good for some height because I need to balance out the big old, big old uh, triple stack candy corn pumpkin. Look at these, these are cute. I'm gonna have these come in. I don't want them as tall as the pumpkin, but a little bit shorter. So we get an idea where I wanna cut them. Okay, so my two, my two pops are in. They're balancing out that nicely. I want to get my ribbons in. So I've tied a couple of bows and they all coordinate with this um, design. So I did one with a long tail on the right and then I did a smaller bow for a long tail on the left. So I'm going to flank the whole design with the two bows, but we're going to get those in first. Uh, these are all, all these supplies are on Colleen's.com. The big pumpkin guy, he came from the at home store. He's creepy. <laughs> She likes candy corn. <laughs> oh, he's got a crow in there. I love that he's got a crow. Should add a crow. <gasps> I have some crows at the warehouse. Boom, boom. Okay, let's put this one on the left. And I'm gonna try to keep it kind of to the front. 
and we'll trim the tails to kind of go around the edges. Let me get a little glue going on here and we'll tuck it in. I love making this stuff with you guys. It's totally fun. And I hope it inspires you. And even if you can't do it, you know, right now, maybe later you're going to have an idea and you're going to be like, yes, I want to add, uh, you know, all the crazy stuff to the top of something else. I like this hanging down. Isn't that cute on the side? Love that. Okay, first bow in. We gotta make, oh, that looks cute tucked in there. Oh, I love it. I love that. Second bow, we're gonna go up a little bit higher up here by the lollipops. All I did was reorder these bows. Um, the ribbons just to change it up a little. I'm gonna go up a little bit higher here under the candies. All right? All right, going up a little higher, tucking it in to this piece of bow up here. Oh my God, how cute is that? I'm loving this. All right, let me bring this down. Yes. And I'm gonna curl these a little bit to get them going where I want them to go. And then we're gonna add like a little bang action up here. I need a little bit of the twigs to be the bangs. Let's add some of the twigs. I'm gonna come on, I wanna break the planes of all of the uh, ribbon up here at the front. I'm gonna get the planes broken of that. All right, I'm gonna bring these down, kind of tucking in and out of those bows. I'm gonna make sure this stays up a little higher. Going in. Oh yeah, cute. I love that. I love that. These little things have little curlies on them and everything. Oh my god, how cute. I love twigs, guys, so live twigs with curlies, I'm in heaven. I'm gonna put a few more. Kind of funky cool, right? Spooky, fun, like he's the king of candy corn. He's a candy corn king. I've got more candy corns to go in here too, but I still want to soften this look. There we go. That's what I was looking for right there. I like that. I love to create whimsical, you know, it's fun too. I'm still going to go hard on these twigs. These are inexpensive, so I'm glad we're using a lot of them. Isn't it turning out adorable? And we're not even done. And I'm not to shop for the perfect crow. I actually think a little, a little, like a little cute rat would be really cute. <laughs> I mean, you don't want to say rats are cute, but in this case, they might be cute. Y'all, the twigs all day long are making this amazing. They are making this amazing. I'm trying to actually go into the pumpkin right there. There we go. So anytime you have a styrofoam base, you can use it too. Let's hit this with, I've got two curly cues that are the same color family as this. So I thought that would be nice to pull that in too. Let's see if we want to use two or one of these. I love them curled. You can always take these guys and do other things with them. You can even straighten them out. You can do whatever you want. They're wired, so you have the control over what you want to do, how much or how little. Let's try to put these curls in right behind the candy, the lollipops. And try to push those right in here. Go down, baby. All right, and I'm going to try to kind of stage it around it right here. Perfect. Okay, I'm loving that. Now I'm going to do the same thing over here, just a little shorter. I'm going to have to add that later. I'm gonna want it a little shorter, but I want one here too, I think. I think I do. They have a little candy corn on top. So look how cute that is. I put that right by the bow there. Let's put another one of these. I'm gonna come over here where the uh, other bow is. I'm gonna try to get this where it can kind of pop out of the bow. So a couple of little cupcakes just popped right. Oh gosh, how cute is that? Okay, here come the candy corns. These are the little short ones. We have these long too. Love that one. Let's put these in. I'm gonna trim that. And I want to use these in here to fill in tight, a little bit shorter, kind of around the bows. Put that one right there. Oh, that's so cute. I love it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Cute. And then I want a little bit something in the middle. Okay, I'm going to put another one right here. I'm going to cut a little bit shorter. Let's come up over here. I'm going to have this one kind of come just a little bit down, a little bit kind of coming over his forehead in here. Cute. Cute. Love that. Can you see him lighten up? And I wonder if I don't try to get some lights up in here. Let me add a couple more of our little uh, marshmallow sprays. And I think I'll be happy. Still want something right there. Maybe a lollipop upside down. So here's a little lollipop. And I wonder if we can, let me just kind of see if I like it. Oh yeah, I think I like it. Just tucked right there, just kind of popping up. There you go. I love it. We pushed that All right, candy corn mania, right? <laughs> Thanks for being uh, with us and hanging out. Bye everybody.